hey y'all welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to do a easy um french braid hairstyle that i'm going to be wearing for a minute um these are my clip-ins that i reviewed in the other video i just deep conditioned them and blew them out so that they can look more like my hair um this is going to be like i said an easy protective style because i don't know like when my baby's coming at this point so i just need something already done to my head so i'm starting off by parting this little bitty section right here i'm gonna add some wild growth oil to my hair because that stuff is life and i'm gonna add this beeswax the murray um you know beeswax not the edge control but the regular one and um, i'm just gonna apply that to this little section and i'm gonna braid it um i don't know what made me do this little braid um uh, it just made it look more interesting and less like just two regular braids it just gave it like a little oomph to it so um, i'm just going to braid that and i'm not going to braid it all the way back as you can see i'm just going to follow the part that i already have in my head and it's going to be like a little half of a braid and then i'm going to braid the ends um probably like a quarter of the way down not all the way because i am going to just add it to the actual big french braid that i'm going to have Alright, so this is how it looks now with just my little one braid. And now I'm just going to part my hair. Um, going back and I'm just going to add these clip-ins. These are 18 inch clip-ins that I blown out with my hair dryer. This one has four clips on it. So I'm using this on my longer side. Well, not my longer side, but the side that's going to be like, I guess my side part. I don't know how to explain it. But anyways, so then I'm going to go in and add one more clip in this clip in has three on it and i'm just going to go ahead and clip that in now these clip ins are actually like a color number two my hair is like a 1b but um yeah it worked out i really didn't care i really didn't even think about dyeing it until afterwards after i had it all in so now i'm just going to comb the clip ins and my hair together look how good that blends y'all look i could just wear it like this but anyways i'm going to use my ant pro style gel and my murray um edge i mean not edge control my murray beeswax i'm just going to go ahead and apply it to the hair now my goal is to not have is not to have it slick i just want it to look like two little cute natural ponytails okay i mean natural braids i want it to look more like my hair my hair is not slick and straight, so I don't want it to be super slick and super straight. So um, after I get done adding the product to it to help it lay down a bit, I'm just going to start braiding it back. Um, I'm actually, if this helps you guys understand, I braided it down and around um, my head to the back. Alright, now when you do this, you want to kind of take your time because, like, um, it is, like, a, a lot of hair that you're braiding together. And you want to make sure that your clippings are not showing. The way that I lay the clippings in my head is um, a way that I suggest you guys to do it if you try this because, like, your clippings are not going to show. All you have to do is pull a little hair over it. You know, like, when you cover your leave out and you sew ends or whatever, you just have to pull a little hair over it. And then continue to braid. You won't even be able to tell that there's clippings um, added to your hair at the end of the style. Okay, so once I get to the back, for now I'm just going to braid it all the way to the end. Because this is like, <laughs> I actually did this video in the same day. But like I had to stop and take a nap because your girl got sleepy. But anywho, I'm just going to braid it to the ends. Just keep everything sealed together. I'm going to do the exact same thing on the other side. I'm going to add my clippings. Tell me this don't look natural though. Excuse my voice too. It's going out. But anyways, that looks so nice and natural. I'm just going to add my gel. Um, I don't know why I like Ant Pro Style Gel. To me, like it defines your twist outs really good. So I just decided to go ahead and slick my hair down with it. And um, yeah, just going by my day. All 
All right, so once I'm done with this side, I'm going to braid it to the end. Um, like I just did the other side, y'all. It's literally the same thing, just a different side. And I'm going to use some, um, oh, this is how it's looking. <laughs> I'm going to use some freeze black spray just to lay down a little flyways at the top. And um, I'm going to put a little bit more gel on it just to help slick that down. I have this little bitty brush. And I'm just going to, you know, lay down the little flyways, like I said. And what I'm going to end up doing is adding some edge control to my edges. I don't know why I added it now instead of at the end of the video, but I did. And then I took a little break. So once I came back, what I did is um, I'm going to show you how I make the ends curly. So with the remaining of the clippings that I have, I'm just literally clipping them to the braid and as you can see like they're still blown out i'm just clipping them to the braid i'm taking a piece of the clip in to wrap it around and then this is how it ends up looking and i'm going to spray it with water so that it'll curl back up and i'm just going to two strand twist it um i noticed that it turns out looking better if you actually braid it instead of two strand twist it but I'm going to show you guys how that looks at the end of the video. So um, I'm just going to twist it up in like two two strand twists. Just so that the ends will be curly. Alright, and so y'all, this is how it turned out. Like I said, it's super easy, y'all. Literally, all you're doing is clipping the clippings in a circle around the braid that you already have established. All right, y'all, so this is how it turned out with the braided ends. The two strand twist ends, I didn't like that much. Hope you guys like this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.